Hurst's confession was false. The Australian Medical Association has launched its position statement on women's health for 2014. Labor Senator Nova Peris was at the launch and says more focus is needed on expanding domestic violence services in the Northern Territory. Senator Peris says recent figures show an Indigenous woman in the Territory is 80 times more likely to be hospitalised from assault than any other Territorian. Every single night our emergency departments in the Northern Territory overflow with women who have been bashed. But although I shudder, it is a fact that I want every Australian to know. It is a fact that no Australian should accept. And tragically, it is getting worse. In 2013, domestic violence assaults increased in the Northern Territory by 22%. Of course, there are many areas of women's health and Aboriginal women's health that need more attention and focus. But stopping this violence is currently a primary focus of mine. An 80% increase in alcohol-related emergency department admission is extraordinary and something that this nation should be ashamed of. Every night the place is awash with the victims of alcohol fueled violence, with the vast majority of victims being women. The human toll is crushing, but the financial toll is enormous. Millions of dollars of extra funding has been expended in an effort to cope with the influx of our emergency departments. So I welcome that the AMA's Women Health Policy states that family and domestic violence is an area that is under addressed and warrants an increased policy focus and high quality service provision. I completely agree.